Well, hello everybody. Welcome back with me. You know me, I'm Kevin. And today, I made my own door decoration. So, well, now, yeah, this is all you can see right now. Well, <clears throat> just start from the outside stuff. LED strip, the RGB one. Well, that's why use, well, of course, you can use the one color such as the blue only, red only, or whatsoever. Well, and for this one, I have a little switch here. It's a master switch, so well, basically, you plug the electricity, which is 12 volts, <clears throat> 2 amps, in, in DC in here, and well, to turn it on, you, of course, just gotta click this thing, and yeah, turn it off, click it again, and now, let's see what's inside. Well, for the box itself, well, I'm using a cheap plastic box where you can basically just make holes like like this one and easily with a solder or, I don't know, whatever you want to use. And in here, well, without the LED strip, if you close this, really, it's a really compact thing. And basically, all the electronics and stuff are all in here. The ad adapter connection, which connects to this thing, like this here. Then there's the 12 volt DC to 5 volt DC adapter for the Arduino itself. So basically, from the adapter, it branches to two things, which is the LED strip, which takes 12 volts, and the Arduino, which takes only 5 volts. And well, you can see here that the cable which is connecting to the Arduino is actually just, well, a normal phone charger cable. So, well, I've got like a freaking lot of these. I just snap one of them and use it on this thing. And well, and well, pretty much the most, one of the most important things, again, is the MOSFETs. These are the MOSFETs. I'm using the... TIP 31C <clears throat> like this one well of course you can just use any other things you want if you know how to use it and how to program it and now well let's see it in action so well now if you want to install this thing well stuff can just get a bit complicated starting from the most complicated one putting the LED script so well now, well, not really complicated though. Just the soldering under this circuit board here. And now, yeah, just pretty much wire everything in here. Then, and yeah, that's it. Close it. Plug the power in. And turn the switch on. And well, now with the roll here, you can see here that it lights up. Well, actually, if you turn it off, you just directly turn it off. And if you turn it on, you'll need like a few seconds like that before this thing can turn on. Well, of course, you can just guess what's going on inside while this is turning on. So, well, now yeah let's just get to the program and well pins for the LED <clears throat> well for the LEDs pin modes and well pretty much everything here is just the transition from color to color like from red then to yellow which is basically red turning on the green and then from yellow to green turning off the red and then green to blue blue Green, green to green plus blue, green plus blue to blue, blue to purple, purple to red, and back. And yeah, that's pretty much it. The program's really simple. But well, I'm not really simple. It it it's you can make it as complicated as you want. Well, now, well, the program was really complicated. Well, the things you need are, well, yeah. Very simple, all for these, nothing else.
Well, except for the 12 volt power source too. <laughs> okay, and yep, this is where stuff gets even more complicated. The entire circuit. Yeah, this is well pretty much kinda like from the 12 volt power source and the converter then the Arduino the TIP 31Cs and to the LED strips and yeah it's really complicated but <clears throat> also it's very hard for me to explain well of course you can just also see the colors of these things and just to make stuff more simple I've already taken out the LED strips and stuff from well yeah pretty much here until like this yeah simple for the power source of the Arduino now well, let's get to in yeah here like this. This is the <clears throat> circuit for the well the LEDs. Well, it's not really like this though, but well, it's got pretty much like everything we need: the 12 volt, and then the Arduino, then the TIP 31C, and yeah, that's pretty much it. <clears throat> so well, now I'm already outside my room. I've already pasted. The entire <coughs> row of LED strip along my door here, and well, of course your room can look like this, but if you can do this, hmm, see, it, it would look much, much better. And well, and know why if you actually just not like open your door and you go in like this, well. You, you'll feel like that you go into another world or something. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Good luck making your own mm, this LED strip door decoration thing. And don't forget to subscribe.